Now more than 2 million Houstonians are under a boil water notice. This comes more than eight hours after a power outage at a water purification plant. The citywide notice was put out last night. KPRC 2's Brittany Jeffers joining us live with who this boil notice is now affecting. Good morning, Brittany. And good morning to you. We are talking about the entire city of Houston here. More than 2 million people affected, which means a lot of homes, a lot of families will be waking up to this news and not just referencing, you know, water that you may use to drink, but also for food prep or even brushing your teeth. So we want you to go ahead and take a look at this map here. Anywhere outlined in red is included in this boil water notice. So more areas could be added to this list. Late last night, the city of Houston put out a list of cities and mud districts that get their water from Houston. They say that you should check with your water provider and follow guidance from your local jurisdictions, and they will let you know specifically which plants they get water from and if you are included in this. So everyone who is affected should boil their water for at least two minutes and then let it cool before using it to drink, cook with, bathe, or brush your teeth. Officials tell KPRC that this boil water notice could be in effect for several days. Now, as you mentioned, this uh, notice was prompted by a drop in water pressure due to a power outage at the East Water Purification Plant. Now, some Houstonians have been critical of the time that it took to notify the public. Yvonne Williams Forrest is the director of Houston Water, and she explained what will happen next in the process. We are waiting for TCEQ to approve our sampling plan. We will begin collecting samples first thing in the morning about 18 hours to incubate, and um, we should have results, submit those to TCQ and get approval to lift the boil water notice. So again, many families, more than 2 million people affected this morning. Many will be boiling their water or going out to buy bottled water. Now we do have a complete list of uh, the areas that are impacted. That is on our website. Just search for this report on clicktohouston.com. Reporting live, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News.